please let's just uh, look at the common wisdom which you already see even in the newspapers. What caused the crisis in terms of fiscal policy? Too much consumption, overconsumption, great parties over, blah, blah, blah. We've, we've read this and heard this 10,000 times. What is the solution to the problem that was induced by overconsumption? More consumption. This is what we want. I mean, government, please spend in our stead. The economy is weak. We don't have enough energy to spend. And this is the problem. We, we have artificial uh, demand. Demand is something that doesn't want to be fulfilled. Demand wants to be multiplied. That is one of the mistakes I think we make. The moment you have something, you're not satisfied. You want more, like a, like a child. Um, and if we don't have enough money, so this is the dictum. The, this is, again, I think the story that we have in our heads. It is consumption that is the engine of the economy. So we must consume. If you run out of money, go into debt, but consume. If you run out of debt possibility, then somebody else has to consume in your stead. OK, the government. So we come to an ironic situation. The government is consuming so that the economy is functional. And here I think um, uh, another, so that's my second uh, remark. My third remark is I don't think this is a crisis of capitalism, by the way. Capitalism had its problems. It has its problems, and it will have its problems, like any other system we've ever constructed or ever will construct, like communism, like feudalism, like merchantilism, anything. Everything has glitches. What I think we are in a crisis of is growth capitalism. And there's a huge difference, and nobody's really called it, na named it. So here I propose a label. This is not capitalism in what we believe in. It is growth capitalism. And this is where we are religiously disappointed that the God of growth left us. And what do we have to sacrifice? Okay, let's sacrifice, I don't know, government cuts, or uh, let's sacrifice um, whatever, austerity measures. It is growth capitalism, the fervent belief that it must grow at all costs that's in crisis. It grew for so long. It grew and it grew and it was beautiful and nobody complained for a generation. One year, minus 3%. How could that be? Gods must hate us. What do we do?